think it's it's just normal to say it first. I mean, there's an exception of there's a, an exception of there's just no physical class. So yeah, I replaced the times for physical class with eating. Mm, I think that's good and not good at the same time. But overall, I think it's okay. I'm adapting and coping really well. I mean, that's what humans very good at. Very good at adapting. Adapting. So, saya ada banyak mengalami peristiwa-peristiwa itu tentu sama ada yang gembira ataupun yang tak apa gembira, happy or un- unpleasant. So I will break it into into two. First one is the happy moments. Um, I would say during um. MCO lockdown I'm I'm pursuing my hobby as playing guitar Saya banyak tengok dekat YouTube Cara-cara uh, apa nak main chords yang baru Chords yang unik Untuk saya able to play more different songs And difficult songs So Banyak lagu-lagu yang saya dah main Yang susah-susah pun saya Able to play And There was this time when I cover lagu Hujan Aku Scandal dekat IG Story And Noh Saleh, penyanyi Hujan uh, Beliau mention saya dekat dia punya IG Story And I would, I was freaking out that night <laughs> And yeah, that that was my happy moment lah kat sini And then yang tak berapa nak happy Hmm When first MCO was imposed, uh, I, 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 I went back to my house the other day in the morning and with some uh, with limited uh, things for me to bring to my house, I left my books in Chimara and uh, I faced difficult times uh, during my Mok Wan, Thai Tu and Makah tak perlu pernah baik. So, nanti saya akan ambil balik buku saya. Uh, masa-masa saya free nanti lah. And then, yeah, any common things lah yang yang happen to everyone. Berat naik. You know, like when you sit at your home, and I'm the eldest one, I I have to eat all the leftovers. So berat naik. Ni pun pipi dah cabi ni. <laughs> and then um, I didn't have the chance to raya a lot as usual like tahun-tahun lepas. Mana just limited visit. I uh, I have to be at my auntie's house for like two hours only, and and I get back to my house. And the second day of raya, macam biasa je. So, let's go. Um, personally, my experience during the COVID-19 lockdown has been really stressful sebab kau ada pressure daripada family kau untuk buat kerja-kerja dekat rumah and then you have pressure from your lecturers to focus on your studies with your finals around the corner, with homeworks due, with attendance that is compulsory, plus with unstable internet connection it hasn't been that easy to cope with this new norm but humans are easy to adapt with changes i think so it's something new that we need to cope so um uh, what is my most memorable and unpleasant memory maybe i'll go first with unpleasant so it has to be to take mock examinations at home me like How can you possibly do that? It's possible, but then you're like, um, eh, you're just like, uh, more memorable, maybe celebrating Raya because it's, everyone's here, everyone's home, and then, it's good. There's a lot of food. Mm, I would say that I have problems in, you know, like, throw back all the memories with my friends during my secondary school and tomorrow. Because like cuti-cuti macam ni biasanya akan keluar dengan orang, so now I miss my friends so much. I miss my study groups. I miss my roommates, and to face new normal, uh, by staying at home all the time, it was not easy for me at first, and now I'm getting used to it. One of the challenges I face uh, during this um, pandemic. Whatever it is, is definitely answering what examinations at home. I find it quite tough to adhere to to adhere to the time. It's, it's tougher than it, the usual thing you know you do at college, but you know we just answer the 
Okay, put it on the list and put it off. What were some of the challenges you faced during the lockdown? Mm, I would say that I have problems in, you know, like, throw back all the memories with my friends during my secondary school and Semara because like cuti-cuti macam ni biasanya akan keluar dengan dia orang. So now I miss my friends so much. I miss my study groups. I miss my roommates and to face new normal uh by staying at home all the time it was not easy for me at first and now I'm getting used to it. How was my studies and was I able to cope and focus on my studies? Studies is quite good. It's, it's higher than average, but first it was a bit hard to cope because everything was new. It's like it's like you were learning. You are learning to read A B C for the first time and focusing. I would say seventy percent of the normal rate. For my studies, it's been really stressful at most because. Uh, with all the pressures and unstable line internet connection, you have to download a pre-recorded session that your lecturers recorded, and you have to watch your classes from there so that you don't lose track of your own syllabus. Ah, uh, dengan exam lagi yang bukan senang nak jawab, because it's not really something that you always do. I mean, since we're Uh, since kecil lagi kita asyik belajar face to face and then bila kena belajar online ni bukanlah satu benda yang macam oh belajar online ok jom belajar online tutup ah, ok faham semua tak dia susah sebab dia benda baru jadi kau kena adapt how did I focus while um, studying at home I mean, uh, I think I just prepare everything like I'm going to class. I wear the appropriate clothes and then I set my table, my stationeries and books and some paper to jot down the notes. So, yeah, to answer you know, exercises from my lecturers.